It's just a case of weird science. Leading American scientist Dr. Bruce Damer is at Rotorua's Hell's Gate, conducting research trials aiming to answer the age-old question, how did we get here? It's very exciting. It's 21st century science, revolutionary science to watch. Uh, if we can find this cycle, it's the engine of creation, effectively. Also that we're, we came not from an individual, not from competing individuals, uh, but from a network, a collaborative community, was at the tap root of the tree of life. Dr. Damer's research could turn previous origins of life science on its head. He's testing whether hot springs on land may have been the starting point for life itself. Dr. Damer's searching for RNA, a nucleic acid, and the basis of all living cells. So what we think is that RNA could have been the first polymer that life synthesized first at random in a process like this and then picked through selection, through these cycling protocells, which we're doing here in the hot spring, picked ones that worked. He's For years, scientists had accepted the theory that life began in hydrothermal vents in the ocean. Charles Darwin once speculated that biological molecules might form in a warm little pond, and Dr. Damer believes this to be much closer to the truth. If we can show to our, our colleagues and to the world that we can self-assemble an important biopolymer of life called RNA in a hot spring pool that's cycling, in the conditions that would have been around in the early Earth on these big volcanic islands, our colleagues are really going to seriously look at doing more experiments. And it'll create a whole movement, a whole sort of paradigm shift in origin of life thinking back to Darwin's warm little pond, only now it's a cycling hot little pool. Jaden McLeod, Local Focus.